In this video, you will learn how to win against the Philidor defense in only 8 moves. Can you believe it? Yes, yes, you heard it right. 8 moves. Hello everyone and welcome back. So, two days ago, started in the Czech Republic the European Chess Championship until age of 16 and the first rank of this tournament is the international master from the Norway Cavallo Axel Bu. I really hope that I pronounced the name correct. So he played against Burg Nicolas with the black pieces and let's learn and you know to improve our knowledge in the defense of the Philidor. So white played the move d4. Oh, maybe I mistake? Maybe it's not the Philidor? No, no, everything is fine, everything under control. Let's see how it goes from here. d6 and now e4. So white is going for the e4 openings. Now knight f6 was played. Of course, the pawn on e4 is under attack and now knight c3 was um, a very logical move, of course. Knight bd7, knight f3, and now e5. This is the Philidor defense. So now white played the move bishop to c4, just developing a piece, and also want to play castle, right? So now bishop e7, and white played the move castle. I can tell you guys that when I was a child, I um, learned a lot openings from the Negi uh, books. He's very, very strong grandmaster from India. And as I remember, the first, um, one of the first moves there is a4. Uh, if I remember correctly, this was his plan to get some advantage space of the queen side and also providing an option to play a5, a6. And don't forget that black's plan here is to play c6 with b6, a6, bishop b7 with b5. So a4 is very important uh, move here just to avoiding the black's plan. And um, as I remember, there is castle, a castle, c6, a3. And there are some lines with knight takes e4, knight takes d5, rook e1. Very strong and important move here. After d takes e4, rook takes e4, e takes d4. And now I remember bishop f4. This is the first uh, line here. And uh, it's it's really nice position to play with the white pieces. But of course, the international master from Norway played a move castle. Very logical, of course. Just uh, castling, uh, keep the king safe and also maybe wants to play the move rookie one in the next move so black played the move castle and now rookie one another developing a rook and improving a piece uh, and now black should have played the move c6 or maybe something around a6 or b6 i don't know something around these lines but black played just a really really blunder can you think about the black's move here he played the move rook to e8 and this is such a blunder why just winning the game absolutely in this moment you can stop the video and think by yourself how white can just manage to win this position and the answer the solution can you ready are you ready are you ready bishop takes f7 brilliant move by the international master from no way after king takes f7 just knight g5 check king g8 and knight e6 and the queen on d8 is trapped and winning the game absolutely for white so after bishop f7 nicolas resigned his game and it's very sad for him i know you know this is the first round in the european chess championship and you know to lose in eight moves is very terrible but i really hope that he can you know come back and uh, let some win games nicolas burg uh, you can do it everything is fine this is life this is sport and i believe in you but you know this is very nice uh, tactic here in the field door defense you can learn it and maybe use it in your next games so ladies and gentlemen i really hope you enjoy this video learn some very beautiful trap in the field door defense and if you like it just smash that like button subscribe my channel see you soon in the next openings traps bye bye